Yo, what is going on guys? This is Successly and welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to use skin decks. So I got a comment on my last video asking for my skin. So I thought I would just make a quick tutorial on how to actually get Minecraft skins. So first open up your browser and look up skin decks. And then click on this top link. Once you're here, you'll see this. Watch out, there are a lot of ads. Be sure to not accidentally click on one because you don't want to get a virus. But first, this is the top page. This basically shows the most used and liked skins. This is the latest page. It shows the latest uh, skins made. And recently commented, same thing, but uh, latest, latest skins with a comment. And then here's the editor. This is where the bread and butter's at. Is that a saying? I don't know. Basically, this is where you can create your own skin. As you can see here, I've created my own skin. First, uh, here, let me reset this quickly. So, you're going to start with this. And here is basically all the parts of your skin. There's going to be the body, which is the main part of the skin, and the outer layer. The outer layer is used for things like crowns, hoodies, and anything of that sort that's not on the same layer as the base. Here you can show and hide your uh, parts of the skin. And here are the tools on the left. Here's the pencil, and you can change the color of the pencil with this uh, color wheel over here. Here's the eraser, it's used to erase stuff. Paintbrush tool, I actually don't know what this is used for. Oh, wait a minute, it just creates different textures, that's sick. I never knew that, okay then. Okay, so you just pick a color and it just makes a ton of different textures, that's actually quite nice. Um, let's just keep going. The eyedropper tool, it, if you use it and click on a thing, it changes your color over here. The paint bucket tool, it just fills the whole area. Undo, redo, and then this uh, changes the color that you have picked. to uh, Plus means slightly darker, uh, minus means slightly lighter. Zoom in and zoom out, and then this is the reset. And I don't actually know what this does either, though. So that's it for the editor, except for the really cool thing this is actually what i use to make my skin you can download and upload skins from your computer so let's say i wanted the, to use the skin in game i would download it but let's say i had a skin that i already had downloaded and i just wanted to change it all i would have to do is press upload from computer click the file that has the skin that you want to use to edit and it'll bring it in here and then you could change it however you like Okay, there's also the upload. This is where you can upload your own skins. Um, you're just going to have to log in, but that's it. And Skin Grabber, this is where you can type in a username of any Minecraft player, and it'll give you their skin. Another thing to do when want, if let's say you want like a certain person's skin. Other than using this, you can go up to this search bar. Let's say I want to use my skin. I would click success. I would write successfully. And here's my skin. Here it is in, in all of its glory. So basically, I posted this skin uh, after making it in the upload. And I'm allowing people to download it over here and edit this skin uh, for their own, to use it for their own. So for that person who commented on my last video wondering how to get my skin, this is how you get it. You just go up here, type in successfully, and it'll be here. And then you press download. And then I'll actually show you guys how to get it into Minecraft. So to get it into Minecraft, you're going to want to open up the Mine the normal Minecraft launcher. If you're using uh, Badline or anything, uh, it won't work. So you're going to have to open the normal Minecraft launcher. I haven't opened it in a while, so it's going through all of its stuff. And then you're going to have it here. And then you're going to click skins. And I have a bunch of skins here. And then you're going to click plus. And then you can name it whatever you want. Slim uh, means that the arms are slightly, uh, the body is slightly uh, slim, uh, not as thick as the classic. As you can see, the arms are slimmer. And then to actually get the skin that you want is you got, all you have to do is click browse, and then it'll bring you, it'll have this pop up, and you're supposed to. Uh, it's going to show all the available files that you can click. So I'm just going to click this skin. And then you, uh, all you have to do is, it, all it just did is brought your skin in. So if you go down to the bottom right, you can do save, which saves it, or save and use. If you click save and use, you just got to use it. 
and it's pretty nice and i hope you guys enjoyed that short tutorial and don't forget to like and subscribe if you learn something new and i'll see you guys next time goodbye